So I'm Ian, uh, I've been assisting on this project with the uh, Bishop Justice Band um, every Wednesday. Um, I've been assisting um, with the creation of their composition that they're going to play. And yeah, we've been working on their improvisation skills, we've been working on boosting their confidence um, in terms of actually creating something completely from scratch, in terms of um, giving them the identity and ideas to actually come up with a really small motif or riff and pass that around the group and work on it, find out what they like about it, find out in a really positive, constructive way how they can develop that riff or maybe they can change something with it, how to apply different harmony to that. I've been playing the trumpet for about eight years now. So the project we've been doing is improvisation where we get to play freely and not follow some sheet music. Um, it's been really difficult, like at the beginning I was really set in my ways to not do improvisation because I absolutely hated it. But after a while I was like, it started getting a bit more comfortable and now I feel like really comfortable in playing solos and improvising. Yeah, composition has been really difficult because we, at the beginning, we were quite do the um, 12 bar blues and quite what we're like, used to, but now it's like, it's expanded from a small story to like a, a big story where we have like loads of different parts and loads of different things going on and solos. Composition is a really, really difficult thing to do. People are always sort of envious of those that play instruments, etc. But I personally am very envious of those that can compose because putting ideas down out of your head into something that actually becomes a piece for others to listen to is incredibly difficult. Um, and so we, we particularly requested the, the kind of angle for the jazz band project to, to go in for them, the students to have a chance to make up their own piece. but work out how you go about doing that. How do you start from nothing um, and turn it into something at the end, as I say, that audiences could then enjoy. 